Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Inside Air Gamer. Welcome back to Brewmaster Beer Brewing Simulator episode number three. So in the last episode, we just kind of finished uh, the first mission. Uh, we made a mistake. Uh, so yeah, we're going to install all of this stuff. So what we did at the very end was pick the next one. We are now in the next uh, season and we've got two jobs. And this is the first one. Hop to it. That's what we're going to go for first. We're going to try and make a, uh, a, a UK IPA and the IBU must be at least 20 um okay so it doesn't really matter what it tastes like as long as it's the ibu is pretty high so we've picked our job and and let's get brewing so look we've made a fantastic collection of beers so far look at this look at that righty so to the next job let's uh, fill up our pot let's get the pot on let's get the water on and as always let's fast forward our time there we go We've overflowed it as usual. And we're going to pour some of this back. I mean, that's pretty much 21. I don't think we should worry about it too much. There we go. So we've done the first part. Add malt extract to brew container. Light malt extract, three kilos. Light malt extract. Where are you? I want three kilos of you, please, sir. Let's pour you in. Look at that lovely gooey stickiness. Wow, it's taken a while to get out of this tin. Let's throw you in the bin. And we want 600 grams of the malt one. Okay, we got to make sure we do this with a bit more precision. So, uh, I got 600 grams. Hey, not bad, not bad. Okay, let's place that back in the fridge. Add steepable grain to brew. Okay, chocolate steepable we want to put in here. These are hops, so I'm pretty sure it's in the uh, other one. One hundred grams. Okay, let's turn you on. So we want to get this to boiling. So it can take a bit of time. It's always that last little bit to get the water over boiling okay nice uh remove the grain okay so we get to remove you are you in the bin i suppose okay add hops to oh add hops to boil 20 grams of the keta teri it's a very small amount of this isn't it Okay, so 50 minutes, we'll just let that clock. Okay, perfect. And we let this boil for 50 minutes, so half past the hour. Okay, we're nearly at half past the hour. Add hops to boil Huntsman flight at 60 grams. 
Okay, so we trade you. We want 60 grams. And we need to wait till half past the hour. And then we need to boil it for 10 minutes. the jubbly okay so let's get all of these out then okay now we've got to cool it down we're gonna give it a date and here we go here's our brew pot we need a fermentation container Take the lid off. Okay, and now we're going to transfer it. Okay, so I'm wondering, do we just put a little bit of water in? Maybe two liters. Oh, I've not been cleaning this. Oh, bugger. Why does no one tell me? Add yeast, North American. Okay. We need 150 grams of that. That's perfect. Let's throw you all in. If we can pour it in. There we go. Let's throw you in the bin. Let's get your lid on. So we've added the yeast. And now we're going to ferment it for 20 degrees at 15 days. Open my calendar. Uh, 15 days. Okay, so we need to add corn sugar of 160 grams. What's left in you? You got enough. Done it again, I was so close. Okay, we need to transfer into our conditioning container. Okay, that, that looks like all of it. This I don't need. That's going to auto clean. Okay, so we've done the sugar, transferred it, and now we need to condition it for 21 days. Let's press V, put our lid back on. 21 days in the calendar. Hopefully we got this right first time around. Let's get out of here. Okay, so taste and package the beer.
extremely hazy. Oh, the APV is damn high. Oh, look at the IBUs in that. It's very heavy. And we've completely knocked that one out of the park. Okay, what are we going to call this? Um, King's IPA? Already done that one. Bottle. There we go. We did get a new bottle. We got the long neck now. Quite like the bird. Okay, it's brown. It's that bit there. You know what? I'm quite happy with how that looks. Okay. We've done that one. It wouldn't use that one. It would be nearly the same if I just used the hops from Germany. There we go. So submit the beer. Hey, I got a new, uh, new thing. I'm now a home brewer. Nice, got a pristine brew. And uh, we've got a new IPA bottle to put on our shelf. I mean, it, it could probably squeeze down there, right? We move them all in closer. I mean, so far so good. Righty then. So we got no job tracked. So hey, we got a garden bruise magnet. Hey, we've got some magnets. What can I do with these? Put them on the fridge. I'll have to find out in a minute. Okay, let's have a look at this quarterly then. So the second job. Uh, so what are we looking for? Batch size small, use at least one hops from Germany. Okay, so if I was to track that job, if I was going to the recipes then, the Dunkel's Whiz Beer, I'm assuming that this is going to use some sort of German uh, hop. I mean, I'd say so, right? The whiz beer should be, uh... Okay, let's pin this recipe. We'll give it a go. Okay, pin recipes... Roth. There you go, from Germany. That's what we want. Bavarian yeast. Everything else we got. Okay, we'll make this beer. Should be pretty straightforward. One would imagine. Let's uh, get everything out of the box. We're getting plenty of ingredients now, aren't we? Okay, so usual malarkey. We get this clock going. Oh, for God's sake. That's bloody annoying when that happens. Okay, we're going to pick you up.
There we go. Get you on the uh, boiling plate here. So there we go. 21 liters of water. Malt extract brew container. Wheat malt extract 2.5 kilos. Okay, we're going to retrieve you 2.5 kilos. So I need to do it in a two. Okay, nice and awkward. Okay, perfect. Okay, add steepable grain brew container Vienna crystal, 150 grams. Okay, heat it up to 100 degrees, of course. Remove grain. Okay, so we've got to remove you then. Add hops to boil 50 minutes. So we want rough at 10 grams. Rough at 10 grams. So 50 minutes. I suppose at this point we might as well wait till the hard pass mark. Okay, so 50 minutes. Add hops to boil for 10 minutes, the Ismagrad at 35. Okay, so that now until half past. Okay, we need to remove the hops. In the bin they go. And now we need to cool it down so let's turn you off and uh, we skip a day now they got the wrong container you know what we might as well just get you out as well because we are going to need you eventually We'll put it down there. I suppose it'll do no harm. Okay, let's pull the lid off you. Quite a dark beer, isn't it? I'm wondering, should we uh, do the same as before? Just maybe a liter of water. Okay, clean it, and then we uh, place it. Okay, 
Okay, we need Bavarian white ale yeast. And 150 grams of you. Now we need to ferment for 20 days, 15 days. Okay, so we need 220 grams. There we go. And now we need to transfer it into our other barrel here. And then we need let it condition for 21 days. Okay, we get to go. Okay, I stowed it. Uh, we can now go and taste our bit. Very fruity, very good winter winter beer. Then okay. Um Oh, what are we going to call it? Um, I don't really know any German words, which is a shame. Um, I should have thought about this before, probably. I'm going to probably give it a terrible name now. Okay, I have no idea. Uh, Munich Punch. Do we call it that? I don't know. I really couldn't think of anything. Belgian bottle's fine. Yeah, I can imagine that being quite good. Okay, template. Um, we can put a mushroom on it. I think that looks okay. I hope we can unlock more templates because we're going to be screwed soon. Perfect. Okay, so we've got another bottle to add to our collection.
Nice. Definitely need more racks. What can we do in here? We have to buy them. Which I'm assuming is from the catalog. Ah, I see, I see. I can put them anywhere I want. Okay, this could be cool because these are my first beers. Maybe they should go here. All right, cool. Now, what about those fridge magnets that I got? Can I do anything with them? Boom. We are the brew masters. Just so you all know. Okay guys, hopefully you've enjoyed that. Let me know if you want to see some more of Brewmaster Beer Brewing Simulator. And uh, we are finished for this season. And obviously we'll just start the next season at the next episode if you want to see more. Um, other than that, myself, thanks for watching and I'll see you at the next one. Bye for now.